All right, guys, what I wanted to do is um, start by first saying that everything's a learning process. So with that being said, as I go throughout, you know, posting to YouTube and, sh and sharing my thoughts, sharing my ideas, um, sharing my energy, what I want to let y'all do is know that I'm going to consistently keep getting better at this. And saying that not for validation outwardly, but to show the process, the journey. People out there that are saying like, yo, I don't have all of the cameras. I don't like know how to speak in front of the camera. Um, I don't know how to do all of the edits. I don't know what, what I don't have 4K on my phone or, or this phone or that phone. And I just don't have the, the, the high power, whatever. None of that stuff matters. You are the power. All of this other stuff is just extras. Be who you are unapologetically, lead with your truth, just be who you are. That's as simple as that. So the reason why I wanna talk about that before I go to this next segment is because I hear that so often that I'm gonna wait until this is in place. I'm gonna wait until I have this. I'm gonna wait until I've made this much money so I can buy the perfect lighting and I can do this and I can do that. But ultimately, you are the light. You are the camera. You are the movie. You are the trend. You are the hottest topic. To speak from your spirit and everything else will fall in place. So, on to the next part of the segment. So, what I wanted to do is break down those definitions from the internal dialogue. So, hold on one second, guys. This is raw. I'm not cutting things out. This is just raw. <clears throat> so, we have our internal dialogue, right? My uh, step one for you would be to create 10 affirmations um, and then affirmations, meaning the action of the action or process of affirming something or being affirmed that something would be you being affirmed. You would affirm yourself emotional support or encouragement, offering yourself emotional support and encouragement. So we're going to break down the definitions a little bit deeper and then get into how we can apply it to our day to day. So stay tuned. Keep it rolling. Keep it rolling. We rolling. We rolling. We live with this, man. This is live. This is live. This is live. <laughs> All right. So now affirmation, a statement asserting the existence or the truth of something, a statement Asserting the existence or the truth of something. Stating. Statement asserting the existence or the truth of something. What is that something? That something is you. Your existence. Your being. Your posture. Standing firm on who you are. Acknowledging that I am. Dot, dot, dot. You finish the sentence. It's as simple as that. Affirming. Asserting. Existence, truth, statement, those powerful words, affirmations. It's as simple as that. Action, the fact or process of doing something typically to achieve an aim. So putting one foot in front of the other to reach my Eat Naked L.A., mellow yellow, apple orange, lemon, turmeric, cayenne, Drink, natural drink. So I know that that sounds funny. What are we talking about Eat Naked LA for? Because Eat Naked LA is the company that fuels me. Eat Naked LA is the company that gives me my meals. How did that happen? I'll give y'all a little story. Action. The ANF action figure. What does the ANF action figure stand for? The ANF action figure. Simply, an individual who first visualizes, right? Here, the mind. You get the signal from the mind. You visualize, you create a vision. You write that vision down on paper. Step two. Step three, you put one foot in front of the other to manifest that vision. Now, when I had nothing, not even a gym membership, fresh out of prison, never took a supplement. It wasn't about supplements for me. Supplements wasn't important. Now, when I had nothing, fresh out of prison, not even a gym membership, had to go buy my groceries. I don't take supplements. 
I went from 175 to 225, 50 pounds while in prison, no supplements, proper nutrition. With that being said, <clears throat> I came out of prison and the mindset was I need to establish relationships that are in alignment with my true self. Supplement companies reached out to me, listen, we can have you push this. Oh, as a matter of fact, let me take that a little, let me take that back a little bit farther. I didn't even have enough followers for supplement, supplement companies to reach out to me. I had a phone and I had my princess. I told my princess to videotape me, just videotape me consistently. While we're in the basement, I'm gonna be working out. Point the camera at me and whatever comes to your mind, coach me, motivate me. Say whatever comes to your mind, princess. And the reason why I did that is because those, that action, the idea, the ANF action figure, the visualization of me having all of these followers and building this empire wasn't born in the physical realm yet. It was in my mind. I seen it. I seen it. So when it comes down to understanding that action is the key, had I not gave my daughter that phone and start getting busy with my sit-ups, my crunches, and, and just putting that energy out there, and then posting and only getting 36 likes. Had I, had I stopped right there, had I stopped my action, my forward momentum right there, I wouldn't be where I'm at today. So action put me in a position five years down the road to be able to have deals with, supplement, with, with meal prep, have deals with meal prep companies high level meal prep companies with quality food where I, don't, I still don't have to take supplements and I still don't take supplements. I get my meals for free in exchange for promotion, of course. The food is good. I'm promoting something that I actually use. Unlike other individuals that are just promoting to get a sale and not even using this stuff. They're lying to you. So my job with my actions is to remain in alignment with my purpose and my mission. Proper nutrition is key. So action is important, guys. Action. Even if, even, if the action even if the action that you're implementing isn't turning over right away, just remember, with every cause is an effect. Cause, effect. Plant the seed, the seed will grow. Plant the seed, nurture it, water it. Affirm yourself. Affirm your movement. Affirm your position. Moving right along. Process. A series of actions or steps taken in order to achieve a particular end. It's the same as action. It takes a process to get through this program. It takes a process to wake up and get through your day. Everything requires a process. It takes a process to meal prep. You got to go to the market. You got to break the food down. You got to do whatever. You got to cook to prepare the food. You got to put the food in the container. Before you even eat the stuff, it's all of this. Pro everything's a process. So if you can't implement a consistent process, and I'm not yelling at y'all. This is just my energy. I'm, I get excited when I'm sharing my truth. I get excited when I'm being who I am. I get excited when I'm connecting in a spirit of positive energy. It's all about positive energy exchange right here. So everything is a process, simply said. Be patient with your process, be patient with yourself, and be consistent. Emotional, I wanted, to, I wanted to really elaborate on emotional because relating to a person's emotions, our emotions control us. People always say don't act off emotions or don't react off emotions or don't allow your emotions to control you. That's extremely hard. When you are an individual who is a human being, we're all human. We all have emotions. So if someone is telling you that they never react off emotion, they're lying to you. Emotion is a, is a part of life. It's a part of our, our nature. Without emotion, we would be walking around like zombies. We'd be emotionless. I'm not asking you to be all googly-eyed and, and, and be a crybaby. What I am saying is understand and tap into the emotional realm of our being because that, for me, has allowed me to be so energetic and driven because even on, when, when things aren't going well, my emotion, relating to the potion, person emotion, arousing or characterized by intense feelings allows me to... Uh, that extra, 
that extra push, that extra drive, that extra conversation with myself that allows me to go over that hump and keep moving forward. That allows me to be able to hop on this camera and have you feel my energy. This isn't fake shit. This isn't filtered. This is raw and uncut. I am who I am. You are who you are. We're meeting here and we're going to build and we're going to feed off of each other's emotion. That's what it's about. Building emotion. When Kobe Bryant died, think about this. Well, less than a, I mean, a little bit over a month ago when the, with the plane crashed. Imagine the emotion. Just go back to the emotion that the world felt. I'm out here. I live out here in LA. It was emotion. The emotion was, was sadness, it was sorrow, it was somber. That controlled people. That's the same with any other emotion. Let's create happy emotions. Let's, let's, instead of looking at his death and becoming sad, let's look at Kobe Bryant's death and have it, and have it motivate us to view life like a shot clock. It's 24 seconds on the shot clock. It's 24 hours in a day. I gotta shoot my shot so that I can score. I don't want to turn over. I don't want to lose the ball. I want to make sure that I'm scoring. So shoot your shot. Rest in peace, Kobe Bryant. That legend showed us a lot. That legend showed us that you can wake up in the morning and you can manifest your vision. And you can be one of the greats. Get, off, get out the stands. Go right at him. Real quick. It was, it, was, it was a short quote, I'm paraphrasing, Kobe Bryant saying that when he first played against Jordan, his teammate told him, look, man, you're a young kid, young kid getting into the, um, just coming into the NBA, we know you came out of high school and everything, but when you're playing against Jordan, man, just don't look him in the eye. He's an assassin. He will, he will, he will, he will do you in on this court, man. He's greatness. And Kobe Bryant's response, and I'm paraphrasing, was, I am that too. I recognize that I will look him in his eyes because I am that too. Own your position. I am that too. It's as simple as that. Look him in the eye, stand up firm, shoulders back, chest up. Stand on your position, affirm yourself, and then reaffirm yourself, guys. Every single second of the fucking day, do you. Every single second of the day, you got this. Look him in the eyes. At a business meeting. Look them in the eyes when you're at that gym. Look them in the eyes when you meet somebody. You shake their hands and you look them right in their eyes. That's what it's all about. When you're talking to your children. When you're talking to your significant other. When you're looking in that mirror, look yourself in the eyes. That's what it's all about. It's about posture. It's about, it's about reaffirming yourself consistently. Moving right along. Support. Oh, we, we forgot. Emotional of a person having feelings ever, ever, hold on, here we go. Of a person having feelings that are easily, that are easily excited. That, my fault, guys. Let's see, that's raw. It's raw and uncut. Of a person having feelings that are easily excited and of a person having of a person that having feelings that are easily excited and openly displayed. Like, think about it, y'all. Sometimes the only time that we get aroused and, and display posture and excitement and, 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 and determination is when we're in the confines of our own home. Think about that. When we're by ourselves, when nobody is watching, we're the strongest, we're the toughest. But when the camera is on, or when you when you gotta go on that court and you gotta produce, or when you gotta go into that business meeting, or when you gotta be in a room where you're super uncomfortable and there's individuals who have more money than you, who have accomplished more than you, who are stronger than you, who are bigger than you, with all of these different things that we create in our mind, we start to feel like we can't have an open display of emotion. We can't have an open display of integrity, of passion, of fire. And I'm telling you to change that. Brainwash yourself into believing that anything can be accomplished and I can accomplish it in any room, in any relationship, in any setting. Be who you are, no matter where you at. Moving right along. Support. Bear all of bear 
all or part of the weight of hold up to bear all of the weight to hold up like the weight of life the weight of your existence the weight of your being it's sometimes so heavy that it can bring you to your knees it's sometimes so heavy that it can break your back it's so sometimes so heavy that every single joint in your body hurts and aches your mind starts to play tricks on you your spirit even feels dark and dim and Shackled, imprisoned in a box. But you know what? You know what? Support starts with the internal dialogue. I will not let this darkness, this current, my current, my present situation, my circumstance stop me. All I understand is go harder, keep pushing, keep driving, never give up, warrior mindset, be fearless. Hard body, strong mind, unbreakable spirit. The mind controls the body, the spirit controls the mind. All I understand is go harder, keep pushing, dig deeper, own it, claim it, bigger, believe it, it's yours, it's yours. You got to see that every day. Don't allow it to stop you. Don't allow it to stop you. Support yourself emotionally. Bear all or part of the weight. Hold up. That's why we strengthen our back. That's why we train our legs. That's why we keep a rock solid core. Because it's the mindset of the warrior that moves in a spirit of positive energy. And he is fearless. We're not running around being terrorists and hurting people. But we are running around standing firm on who we are. Wherever we are. And we are fearless along our pursuit of becoming who we visualize ourselves of becoming. Don't forget that. Encouragement. Hold on. Back to support. Be capable of sustaining. Sustaining. Sustaining is a powerful word. I must be capable of sustaining. Be capable. How do we become capable? It's a process. It's a journey. It's exercise. It's repetition. It's consistency. It's implementing. It's learning. It's being a student of knowledge. It's being a student of action. It's having posture. It's being firm on who you are. It's acknowledging that I am. Dot, dot, dot. You finish the sentence. You define yourself. Nobody built like you. You design yourself. Shout out to Jay-Z with that quote right there. You designed yourself. Nobody built like you. Nobody built like you. You design yourself. You design yourself. I see, I said, my one-of-a-kind self. My one-of-a-kind self. There's nobody like you. Be that. Be who you are. Encouragement, the action of giving someone support, confidence, or hope. The action of giving someone support, confidence, or hope. Support, confidence, hope. Support yourself. Be confident in your posture. And if you're not confident in your posture in front of a lot of people, start by being confident in front of that reflection. Talk to that reflection. You are unbreakable. You are unstoppable. You are built to last. You are born to win. You are unbreakable. You are fearless along your pursuit of manifesting everything that you visualize. You have the power to create. You have the power to man. M-A-N. Ifest. Manifest. All that you desire. Be who you are. Stand firm on your belief system. Keep chipping away. Keep driving. Never give up. That's what I want you to say to your reflection. Every single second. Every day that you wake up. This is the internal dialogue. This is what you have to do when you wake up. Consistently. Wake up and be that which you see. Be what you see. You see it already. It's here in this dimension. This dimension creates all of this. Be this. Be this right here. Okay.
uh, encouragement, persuasion, persuasion. You have to persuade yourself. There's so many people that are trying to persuade us every day into doing something. Right now, I'm trying to persuade you. What am I trying to persuade you to do? To believe in yourself. Not to believe in me, to believe in who you are, to believe in that reflection, to validate that reflection. You got this. I'm going to persuade you into believing in yourself. Why? Because I believe in myself. Why? Because I believe in me and I see myself in you. And I'm speaking to the camera because it was one point in my life where I didn't believe. All I seen was darkness all around me. I didn't see nothing. I didn't see me doing this. I see darkness. I see death. I see death. I see prison. I see the box. Solitary confinement. Darkness. <laughs> Let's go away hey, enough. Persuasion to do or to continue something. To do action or continue, persevere, something. Do something. You are energy in motion. You are energy in motion. Flow. Flow. You are energy in motion. Flow. Flow. You are energy in motion. Flow through the universe. Plant seeds. Manifest. Visualize. Commit. Manifest. Man is. M-A-N, all caps, I-F-E-S-T, manifest. The action of trying to stimulate the development of an activity, state, or belief. And I got belief in all caps. Why? Because our beliefs control us. Just look at religion. Look at the military. Just look. You're the student in college. Do you believe? That's the question. If you believe, then you know. Once you believe deep down in your spirit, in your core, once you believe, that belief turns into knowing. And knowing turns into posture. And posture turns into strength. And strength turns into having the ability to persevere through challenges and hop over obstacles and model that to family members, friends, clients, business partners, the world, the universe, YouTube, Instagram. I am the ANF action figure. All I understand is go harder, keep pushing, dig deeper, own it, claim it, be it, believe it. You are a warrior because your mindset is built on establishing the warrior's perception. You are fearless because you told yourself you were fearless over and over and over again until you started to embody that which you gave your subconscious. Simple. Let's break it down. Stimulate. I'm stimulated right now. I'm ready to go and I don't take pre-workout. This is me, my energy, this is my spirit. Locked in to the matrix that I have created. I have created a matrix where I have unlimited energy, unlimited potential, unlimited resources to create the world that I desire to live in. I am stimulated consistently. Stimulation is major. I feel it in my body. It's all through my veins. It's not a steroid. It's not a supplement. It's energy. I am energy in motion. I am stimulated all day long. I am ready to go. Let's get it. And I hope that when you watch this, this makes you stimulated and and ready to create your own matrix and be your own energy and posture up and stand firm on who you are. Validate that reflection. Stimulate the mind. Stimulate the spirit. Stimulate the body. Ooh, yes, it's not just about building muscle. It's about building the, the reserve. It's about clearing and bring, it's about clearing out all of the stuff that's not real and creating your own matrix, creating your own definitions, 
creating your own environment. Stimulation. I'm stimulated. I feel good. It's like, who? Yeah, I got the jitters, and it ain't about a pre-workout. I got the jitters because this, I'm, I'm, I'm happy for life. I'm happy to be able to be alive. I'm happy to be able to be a free man. I'm happy to be able to love my son, hug and kiss and love my daughter, hug and kiss and love my son, love my sisters, love my brother, love the world, put out love, put out energy, encourage my clients. Encourage family, friends, follows who have never ever met me that can feel this energy coming through the camera. This is raw and uncut. This is my spirit I'm pouring out to you. Enjoy. Stimulate the development. We must develop, not big, just big biceps and rock solid abs and a solid chest and a strong back and solid legs. We must develop the mind. We must develop the spirit. We must stay connected with the development process. Repetition, set after set after rep after rep. It's about developing integrity, developing posture, developing the warrior's mindset, developing the fearless mindset, developing the outlook on life that everything is positive. Mr. Optimistic, you can call me that. I am all that I say I am. Develop. Just like we develop the muscle every day, we feed the body and you know we go through our sets and we go through our reps and work this program, work that program. Develop your spirit. We'll create exercises that you have to do to develop the spirit, the mind. Develop the mind. It's resistance. We got this. Development of an activity. An activity. Active action. Activity. Be active. Involve. Get involved with some activities that will strengthen the courage and the encouragement of you. You owe it to yourself. I love you, man. You owe it to yourself. I say I love you, I'm looking at my reflection. And when I look at my reflection, I not only see myself, I see individuals who look like myself. It's not a color thing, it's a human being thing. Let's break down those barriers, man. <laughs> state, activity, state, or belief. State, what state of mind am I in? What state of spirit am I in? What state of body am I in? What is my state of mind? That's a question to ask yourself. What is my state of mind? What is my current state of mind? And if, you, if you don't like your current state of mind, change it. You have the power to change it. Start by acknowledging your strengths and your weaknesses. <laughs> okay? Or belief. Lastly, to finish this off, my belief. What is my belief? What do I believe? Do I believe only the things that I'm taught by other people? Hmm. But wouldn't that be an agenda? Wouldn't I be following an agenda? Or do I believe, this is what I believe personally, I believe that my spirit, my spirit gives me the answers. I believe what I believe because I feel it. I hear it. It's in my mind. Belief starts internally. Listen. Belief is the biggest word on here. Why? Was well, because if I can convince myself to believe in myself, I can then create affirmations that reflect that strong belief. I can then act in a manner that reflects that strong belief. I can then walk through or navigate throughout the process when things become challenging because I have with me safeguarded internally a strong belief in myself. I can then recognize, I can then pick apart, I can then express 
my emotions without fear of being condemned, without fear of being ostracized, without fear of being ridiculed because I believe in me and my emotions are a part of me. So I am then fearless along my pursuit. When you believe, you have something to support. Remember, belief. And I go back to religion. When people have belief, a belief system, it's supportive. Even when they have those trials, even when they have, have, have those dark days when things aren't working, it's the belief that allows us to affirm, act, Navigate through the process, express our emotions, support ourselves, and lastly, stay encouraged. A strong belief leads to consistent encouragement. In closing, y'all, much love, man, to everybody out there on the mission. Be patient with yourself. I hope that the words with my, it is my intention that the words that I have shared, the energy that I've shared with you guys today will penetrate in a manner that is all productive, positive, uplifting, and consistently encouraging. So you have this as a part of history. This is a part of my truth. And I'm going to consistently keep sharing my truth with y'all. Much love, much respect, all positive vibes. Salute to everybody out there in the mission. A&F. Peace.